So guys, we have a new update in regards to the damage migration, an official update from People Can Fly. Today, we're getting to all the latest news. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ, and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. And if you like what you see and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so if you ain't aware, and I don't know how you won't be, there's basically a bug in place in the game right now where a lot of people out of nowhere seemingly are being one shot by enemies that have no right in doing so. Your health, your shield just gets completely drained. It's a bug I myself have encountered. It's a bug many, many players have encountered. I made a video on it earlier this week and talked about a possible workaround found by Chadley. But today we have an official update from People Can Fly in regards to the bug, new information on it, and again, a workaround. So let's get into it. And this is come straight from their Reddit post, dropped literally 10 minutes minutes ago. Okay, so as you can see, latest update here, the 7th of May 2021. We believe we have identified one of the core underlying reasons for lack of damage migration in certain circumstances. We are compiling and testing a new build with this fix included, but doing so will take a bit more time and the final rollout will be dependent on it being successfully tested, confirmed as fixed. We will update you as soon as we have news. While we continue to work on this matter, here are some potential workarounds which have helped some players who encountered the issue consistently. Unequip all your armor, then re-equip it again. If this doesn't help, unequip all armor, hard restart your game. This means not returning to the lobby screen, this means restarting the game completely from the dashboard. Then once you load back in, re-equip the said armor. Or you can unequip all armor, change to a different character and back out, then re-equip said armor. Using mods such as Life of the Party may help increase survivability as this mod works differently to other defensive mods. Avoid tanking brood mothers and alphas in particular as they are particularly prone to the below explained 1 slash 2 hit risk. Explanation to this bug. Once the bug occurs, all regular armor mods are much less effective, so most defensive mods are less viable. The matter of instant deaths, even when they appear to be a one-shot kill, looks to be a case of two damage hits being dealt, though they are displayed as one meaning that the one-shot kill protection mechanic doesn't trigger since they detect two damage hits. And that is it guys, that is what they've said. So they've obviously figured out uh, one of the main problems to this. Like they said, they're testing and working on a fix which will be incorporated soon. But right now they talk about workarounds. Now these are the same workarounds I covered in a video earlier this week found by Chadley, uh, a fellow content creator and streamer. But this is just a confirmation that these workarounds will work. Although if I check the comment section of that video I posted, it seems to work for many, many people and it did work for me as well. So yes guys, the damage migration issue we know is a problem. Although a lot of people at first thought it was an excuse for them fixing the golem mod. I can never remember what that golem mod is, you know, the protective golem mod, whatever it's called. A lot of people blame that and since that was fixed, a lot of people can't hack the game anymore due to relying on said perk. But this is a much, much deeper issue and it's a problem many people who didn't use that mod have experienced. So yes guys, this is the latest news in regards to the game and its damage migration issue. Let's hope when a patch finally comes for this, nothing else occurs in terms of other issues. But yeah guys, just keeping you guys up to date on the latest news surrounding this game. A short but sweet one this Friday, and I hope you enjoy the rest of your weekends. On that note, the end of the video has arrived. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Outriders on a daily basis, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by, and hopefully I will see you on that next one.